Now, let's solve the problem. Without using trigonometric tables, evaluate. Tan 25 degree divided by cosecant 65 degree the whole square plus cot 25 degree divided by secant 65 degree the whole square plus 2 into tan 18 degree into tan 45 degree into tan 72 degree. Now, let's evaluate the value of this. Tan 25 degree, let me write as it is. Tan 25 degree divided by this cosecant 65 degree, I can write it as cosecant, let me write as it is. This 65, I can write it as 90 degree minus 25 degree because it is 65, 90 minus 25 is 65. Therefore, this 65, I will write it as 90 degree minus 25 degree. Whole square plus cot 25 degree, let me write as it is. Cot 25 degree divided by secant. This 65 degree, I can write it as 90 degree minus 25 degree. 90 degree minus 25 degree. Whole square plus 2. This tan 18 degree and tan 72 degree. Let me write together. Tan 18 degree into tan 72 degree. Into tan 45 degree. Here these two I have written together just to make it easy. Okay. Tan 25 degree. Divided by cosecant 90 degree minus 25 degree. We know that cosecant 90 degree minus theta is secant theta. Here cosecant 90 degree minus theta. Here in the place of theta we have 25 degree. Therefore it will become secant 25 degree. Okay. So this one I can write it as secant 25 degree. Whole square. Plus, cot 25 degree divided by secant 90 degree minus theta. Secant 90 degree minus theta is cosecant theta. Right? Therefore, secant 90 degree minus 25 degree. Secant 90 degree minus 25 degree can be written as cosecant 25 degree. So, this one I will write it as cosecant 25 degree. Whole square. Okay. Plus 2 tan. This 18 degree I can write it as 90 minus 72. 90 minus 72 is 18 degree. Therefore, this 18 degree, I will write it as 90 degree minus 72 degree into tan 72 degree into tan 45 degree. Okay? Let me rub this. Tan 25 degree. Now see it. we know that tan theta is equal to sin theta divided by cos theta. Therefore, this tan 25 degree can be written as sin 25 divided by cos 25. Sin, sin 25 degree divided by cos 25 degree. Whole divided by secant 25 degree. Secant 25 degree, I can write it as 1 by cos 25 degree. Because secant theta is equal to 1 by cos theta. 
therefore this second 25 degree i will write it as 1 by cos 25 degree whole square okay plus cos 25 degree can be written as cos 25 degree divided by sin 25 degree because cot theta is equal to cos theta divided by sin theta. Therefore, this cot 25 degree, I will write it as cos 25 degree divided by sin 25 degree. Whole divided by cosecant 25 degree. I can write it as 1 by sin 25 degree. Because cosecant theta is equal to 1 by sin theta. 1 by sin 25 degree whole square plus 2 tan 90 degree minus theta what it will become tan 90 degree minus theta is cos theta, cot theta in the same way tan 90 degree Minus in the place of theta we have 72. Therefore it will become cot 72 degree. Okay. Therefore this one I can write it as cot 72 degree. Into tan 72 degree. Let me rub this. Into tan 45 degree. Okay. Now, let me do the square of this. I will rub these two steps. You can copy down. Okay. Now, it will become sin square 25 degree. Sin square 25 degree divided by cos square 25 degree cos square 25 degree whole divided by 1 square 1 square is nothing but 1 so let me write 1 itself divided by cos square 25 plus cos square 25 divided by sin square 25 Whole divided by 1 square is 1. So let me write 1 itself. Divided by sin square 25. Plus 2. Cot theta. It is the reciprocal of tan theta. Right? That is cot theta is equal to 1 by tan theta. So this cos 72 degree, I can write it as 1 by tan 72 degree. This cos 72 degree, I will write it as 1 by tan 72 degree. Into tan 72 degree. Into tan 45 degree. Okay. Now let me rub this. Now look at this. Cos square 25, cos square 25, it will get cancelled. Here sin square 25, sin square 25, it will cancel. Okay. Plus tan 72 degree, tan 72 degree, it will get cancelled. What is left here? Sin square 25 degree divided by 1 plus cos square 25 degree divided by 1 plus 2 here what is left tan 45 degree now take the LCM one is the LCM right here therefore one is the LCM therefore it will become sin square 25 plus cos square 25 since here 1 is in the denominator, no need to write. I will rub this, okay? Plus 2. 
we know the value of tan 45 degree. Here we have to use the trigonometric table. What is the value of tan 45 degree in the trigonometric table? It is 1. Right? Therefore, this tan 45 degree, I would write it as 1. And we know another formula. Sin square theta plus cos square theta is 1. Sin square theta plus cos square theta is 1. Here we have sin square 25 degree plus cos square 25 degree is what? 1. Because theta is same. Right? Therefore, sin square 25 degree plus cos square 25 degree is 1. This one is 1. Plus 2 into 1 is 2. That is 1 plus 2 is 3. Hope you have understood. Thank you.